Hello, this is Martin Brossman, KI4CFS, and I want to bring up a topic that I'm very passionate about, and that's that we keep working to allow for remote testing in special cases of the amateur radio exams. The reason for this is I think there are a lot of people that are housebound, and especially a number of our very good uh, veterans that may in some ways not be able to easily get out of the house. And amateur radio is an excellent resource in emergencies or in this time when many people are self-isolating in their homes to be able to stay connected to the world. And one of the things I noticed is right now is all the testing in many places has been shut down. I understand why safety first, but that leads to the comment, why don't we allow for remote testing? We have the creative and technical ability. I mean, we're a hobby of inventing things. Testing can be done and should be done and should be available. It doesn't mean we might not need a webcam to make sure they're sitting there. I mean, I I teach all the time. If you're like looking over here and it could be a cheat sheet there, it's pretty obvious that maybe someone else is uh, not following the rules of uh, working with the exam. Uh, we could require possibly uh, one person that would need to be there of authority as a secondary validation. And I want to see this happen. I want to, I'm an active member of ARRL, which I recommend you be one as well. I just passed my extra test and I could have sworn, I'm going to look back on it. It was one of the questions that it could be offered. Then I found out it couldn't. Then I called ARL and uh, they said to the best of their knowledge, it wasn't. I do know there's a group in Alaska doing some experiments with it. I'll put that link below. Someone found it in a Reddit comment. But if you believe this is important, which I do as a ham operator, especially for those people who can't easily get out of their home, let's communicate to our leaders and authority that are, are speaking our, our behalf, specifically uh, the ARRL working in partnership with FCC, and make sure to take the action and say, you want this. You're asking for it. You'd like to know how to help and how to make it a reality as soon as possible so people could take with possibly uh, clear agreements that they can't get out or limitations could take the amateur radio test and be able to get on the air without having to leave their home. And I think this crisis is a wake-up call that we need to make this an offer. If you agree, first comment below so I know you're listening and you agree or not. But what really matters is that you communicate uh, to ARRL as an active member and say, this is important, you want it. If you know other information, if you think I'm off base with that, let me know as well. And you all have a great day and be safe. And I'm grateful that I'm a ham operator at home with limited going out for safety and my family. And I've got this as a resource. Take care. Thanks.